Hi everybody, my name is Mike, and I'm one of the aquarists here at Birch, and you guys are here for another exciting episode of Behind the Scenes at Birch. Um, so today I'm going to talk a little bit about our kelp forest exhibit. So if you guys have been here before, it's our largest display. People always ask, why do we have the motion in the tank? And you're going to notice it a lot up at this top right hand side, and those are some of our sea palms, and you can really see them moving back and forth. So we do this for a couple of reasons. One, it's really great for the health of our fish. Two, with all of our algae in here, they don't have roots like terrestrial plants, so they actually take their nutrients in through their blades, or what you might think of as leaves. And so by having that constant movement, it allows our algae, like our sea palms, our kelp, as well as our other algae to bring in that nutrients. Another really fun thing before we jump behind the scenes and I show you how we make this wave is if you look down here at this rock, you can see some nice red algae. And so that right there is a little farm from our California State Marine Fish. That's going to be our Garibaldi, Tipsy Pops Rubicundus. And if you look, they're actually our bright orange goldfish, but they're actually a damsel. And so our male every spring will come and he'll make that nest. And so basically he'll cultivate that red algae. The bigger his nest is and the cleaner it is, the more likely a female is gonna lay her eggs there. And so this male for the past five to 10 years is getting a female to lay eggs every season and multiple times throughout that season. So hopefully in the next coming weeks, we'll see some eggs on there. So give me a couple seconds and we're gonna jump up up top. Oh gosh, that was my radio, don't mind that. So this is our wave machine, so it's a giant plunger. So basically we're moving all of this water in order to get that motion in our kelp tank. If we look to the two sides, you're gonna see we have this awesome green layer up at the surface. That's gonna be our ova, and those are gonna be the highest algaes that we get. That's gonna be that upper tidal zone. And if you look around the edge over there on that far side, you're gonna see that same thing. You're going to see we get a really great movement of water. This is incredibly important and we're one of the few aquariums in the world that can do it. And so by having this, it gives us, a, us the opportunity to have live algae. And what's really amazing is we actually use raw seawater. So our seawater gets pumped up from the Scripps Pier and part of the amazing thing with that is all of these algae, like our sea palms, naturally accrue in here. And so, and then also with all of that, we get all that really amazing nutrients coming in, which allows us to grow them. Well, thank you guys so much for joining me on Behind the Scenes at Birch. Hope you have a wonderful day.